Pickant the syllabus is the student's first introduction to you as an instructor. You need to pay attention to the tone of your syllabus. Let's talk about key things to keep in mind in regards to tone. When we feel like an online experience is a conversation, we tend to pay more attention. Make a learning experience a personal one and talk directly to the learner. So instead of saying, this unit covers three tips for writing a better syllabus, say, let's look at three tips that you can use to write a better syllabus. Use personal pronouns, such as you, your, or us, rather than the students, the course, or they. We also tend to remember information and experiences that trigger an emotional response. To make your learning memorable, use humor, if you can, to engage the audience. You may also want to use audio or visual examples that play to a range of emotions. Instead of boring pictures, use fun images that nurture students' imagination and trigger their emotions. Students want to learn from instructor who seems to be connected and personal. They love when you share stories about your life. Personal experiences can be compelling when they also suit the content of the class. Make an example from your life rather than a textbook where possible. Connect theory with the real world. The tone of the syllabus should be positive, respectful, and inviting. Focus on learning and possibilities. Frame policies in a positive way rather than negative. Use supportive statements, such as, I welcome you to contact me outside of the class, instead of, if you need to contact me outside of office hours, you may email me. Or, I hope you can actively participate in the course, instead of, come prepared to actively participate in the course. Research reveals that friendly syllabus not only encourages students and enhances their performance, but develops a more positive attitude towards the course and the instructor. Interestingly, some research revealed that students expect the course to be easier if the syllabus is written in a friendly tone and even want to take another class with this instructor. Please try to avoid unnecessary complicated language, especially when you frame the learning objectives. Use the language that allows learners, including non-native speakers, to grasp the meaning quickly. Specific terminology, however, is essential and students need to acquire it. If you need to use terminology in the syllabus, explain what the term means. Thus, to provide the learner-centered experiences, please aim to establish rapport, trigger an emotion, share personal experience, use positive language, and avoid jargon.